we haven't a clue what the farm's worth or what we're worth. But all we know is we've got money in the bank, we work hard. Our only problem is I think we work very hard for what we do make. So this was the old dairy where we used to pasteurise the milk, yeah. bring it down the yard from the cows. It's old, as you can see. In times gone by, Castle Hill was a lucrative dairy farm, running one of the largest milk rounds in Lancashire. But times have changed. What's all that in there, then? That's tomorrow morning's milk. Ian's out on the milk round tomorrow morning with that. But um, you don't milk cows anymore, do no, you? No, unless you're actually doing it in a mass way now, milking cows, it's just not worth it. No. Not for the size of the herd that we had. Uh, we're predominantly beef now. So, let me get this right. So you buy in that milk, yeah. have it delivered here, yeah. and then you're... I taking deliver it, out. it to the doorstep. You're yeah. doing a milk round? Yeah, milk round. All yeah. right, yeah, yeah. What time um, of the... Two in the morning. Two in the morning. Really? Yeah. Two Not in the... past two. That's extraordinary you're getting up at two o'clock in the morning to deliver someone else's milk. It's no secret that farming is hard work, but I'm surprised that Karen is still standing. Ian and Karen are putting in a phenomenal amount of working hours for very little return. But the history of the farm means making changes won't be easy. It's in Ian's blood, it's in Gemma's blood. It says on Ian's letterheads here, this was what his dad used to have on milk producers since 1922. And that's what we're carrying on. You know, you two, how long are you going to keep doing your milk rounds? You literally do it till the day you die if we don't intervene. 